other coders. The behavior of an entity is not only a direct result of the input, but it also depends on its preceding state. UML state machine diagram, or sometimes referred to simply as state diagram, or state machine, or state chart, shows the various states of entities. State machine diagrams can also show how an entity reacts to various events, moving from one state to another, and can be used to model the dynamic nature of the system. State machine diagram is typically used to describe the state-dependent behavior of an object. An object reacts differently to the same event depending on the state it is in. Although state diagrams are mainly applied to objects, they can be applied to any element that changes behavior in relation to other objects, such as actors, use cases, methods, subsystems, systems, etc. And they're usually used in conjunction with sequence diagrams. State machine diagram describes all events as well as states and transitions for a single object. A sequence diagram describes the events for a single interaction across all objects involved. Let's have a look at the notation used in the state machine diagrams. State is a constraint or a situation in the life cycle of an object in which a constraint holds. The object performs a certain activity or expects an event. An event is a significant occurrence allocated in time and space. In the context of states, an event is the occurrence of a stimulus that can initiate a state transition. Guard condition is evaluated after the state transition trigger event occurs. You can have several transitions from the same initial state and with the same event trigger, if only the guard condition do not overlap. A guard condition is evaluated only once for the transition at the time when the event occurs. The Boolean expression can refer to the state of the object. A transition is a relationship between two states, indicating that an object from the first state will enter the second state when the specified event occurs and the specified conditions are satisfied. An action is an executable atomic computation that changes the state of the model or returns a value. A state is a point in the life cycle of a model element that satisfies some condition where some specific action is performed or where some event is expected. There are also two states with a specific predefined role. First one is the initial state, which is indicated by a solid circle. A transition from the state will show the first real state and the final state which is shown as a concentric circle. In case of an open loop state machine an object may terminate before the system terminates while a closed loop state machine diagram does not have a final state. If it is the case then the object lives until the entire system terminates. Events are occurrences that cause objects to transition from one state to another. An event can be one of four types. Signal event corresponds to the arrival of an asynchronous message or signal. Call event corresponds to the arrival of a procedural call to an operation. Time event occurs after a specified time has elapsed. And change event occurs whenever the specified condition is met. Transition lines depict movement from one state to another. Each transition line is marked with an event that triggers the transition. Considering a system as a collection of states and transitions between states is very useful for describing complex behavior. Understanding state transitions is an important part of system analysis and design. Transitions between states occur as follow. The item is in its original state. Event occurs. Action is performed. Element enters target state. Multiple transitions occur either when different events lead to the termination of the state or when there are guard conditions on the transitions. Transition without an event and action is known as automatic transition. Action is an executable atomic computation which includes operation calls, the creation or destruction of another object or sending of a signal to an object. 
the action is associated with the transitions during which the action is not interruptible, for example, entry or exit. This diagram shows the state of the MyBK copy object from the book copy class. Entry action is any action that is executed whenever an object enters the specified state. Exit action is any action that is executed whenever an object leaves the state. Now let's talk about substates. A simple state is a state that does not have a substructure. A state that has substates or nested states is called a composite state. Substates can be nested at any level. A nested state can have at most one initial state and one final state. Substates are used to simplify complex state diagrams, showing that some states are possible only within a specific context. State diagrams are often used for deriving test cases. Here is a list of possible test ideas. Idle state receives to hot event. Idle state receives to cold event. The cooling startup state receives the compressor start event. Cooling ready state receives a fan run event. The cooling run state receives OK event. Cooling run state receives a failure event. Failure state receives error reset event. Heating state receives an OK event. Heating state receives a failure event. Nested states are necessary when the activity involves concurrent subactivities. In this diagram, an auction was modeled with two concurrent substates, bid processing and payment limit authorization. In this example, the state machine first entering the auction requires a fork at the start into two separate threads. Each substate has an exit state to mark the end of the thread. If there is no abnormal exit, which is cancellation or rejection, then the exit from the composite state occurs when both substates exit. Unless it's specified otherwise, when a transition enters a composite state, the action of the nested state machine starts over again at the initial state, unless the transition is aimed directly at the substate. History states allow the state machine to re-enter the last substate that was active prior to leaving the composite state. A history state is indicated by a circle with the letter H inside. Please give this video Emperor's thumbs up, toll the bell and subscribe. That was V, thank you and goodbye.